Hey family, welcome back to the channel. Today I am sharing some of my little kitchen tools. I just got this puppy. Isn't she beautiful? This is my new snack tray for all of my keto snacks or my more healthy eating snacks. So if you guys are interested in some of those, that's what I have. This one is peanut butter. They're all delicious. Uh, I would recommend if you really want to enjoy the brownie, nuke that for about 10 to 15 seconds, depending on your um, depending on your microwave strength. And then let's see. Yeah, so we have two of each. Whoa, shoot. <laughs> okay, we have two of each, and we have already eaten, started eating some, but I only eat like one, maybe per day. And sometimes I skip a day as well. But I wanted to share this because I always find some really cute stuff for the kitchen. And I said, well, not share with my girls because we are all, this is the time of the year where we are fixing up, changing, uh, extending, removing, replacing, and all that jazz. So I, and this is my other little toy that I got. Um, I used to have a regular spoon holder and I got tired of that because I always have to still put my, um, the lid down onto my counter and I don't like that. So now this holds my lid. It the base of it rests here and then it it's you know rests up against here and then my spoon go in there and this came with an extra they sent an extra spoon holder so that's good you could just place it right there or if you don't want to maybe you know stain your stainless steel you could put that right in there it's probably what I would do and let it rest there but yeah I got tired of just that single just this single um, porcelain one that I have. So this, I haven't put the screws on the bottom <laughs> because of my nails. So I'm gonna let hubby do that. That's why it's not secure, but that's what it would be like. And I wish I could put, hold on a minute, y'all. Let me see something, if I could get it. I'm trying to, I got these child lock things on here. See like these, they're on every cabinet. I can't do it right now. I wish I had a lid to show you guys. Oh, well, we have this one over here that's clean. <laughs> so it would rest the idea. And think about it, it has to be secure as well, right? So it's going to rest there. And then it's going to be, that's going to be strong. And it's going to let it rest right there. So you could just grab it each time. And then you put your spoon right there. So very, very convenient. Very, very convenient. But I don't have a screw in it. But just to give you guys an idea. Okay, ladies, I'm back. You know we just cannot take no for an answer for ourselves. We'd be so determined. I was like, oh, my nails are in the way. I'll let her be put together my little pot and spoon holder. But I found my pliers, girl, and I got it done. Here you go. So if you are interested, take a good look at how it is set up. I love it. It's so convenient. And you can swap out this I already have but um you could swap out if you don't want it directly on there go ahead and place it on here and do a little something like this if you so choose Ooh, let me move it over a little bit yeah and it rests per perfectly that way you don't have to worry about um your sauces all over your counters um, you don't have to worry about a hot pot sweating onto the counters or touching you. You just lean it right up against there, and it's stable now, as you can see. Um, your butter, juices, oils, water will all drip right there. And then if you want a smaller one, let's just say you're doing only a teaspoon, or I guess I should grab a teaspoon, huh? Or a so I wanted you guys to see what it looks like right next to the stove. We also got, this is another, now my husband ordered this grease can um, because we do fish fry Fridays every Friday. And so it has a strainer, really nice little unit. And it comes with the drip pan as well. So, um, but this is what this looks like. So if you are cooking it up, you could do this. Throw that right in there, grab that and boom same thing everything oops sorry is one-handed you don't have to be worried about oh it's gonna fall over okay so check it out i'll link the link below i got it from amazon all right let's load this puppy up um 
I love this color. I'm so into like my goals now. And FYI, I also opted for this to be hard plastic because Joshua can reach this island and he will occasionally he'll knock stuff over and I don't want that. So um, if he knocks this over, I won't be just bone butt crushed. You know what I'm saying? If it smacks, it probably will not break. So we'll be good there versus if it's porcelain. It's a wrap. It's pretty much a wrap. So we're going to take out some cheesecake. And we're putting some cheesecake down here. I think I'm going to alternate these as well. So let's throw some nutty fudge brownies in here. Hubby did good with snacks. <laughs> okay, so what we're going to do, get these ready for the garbage. Let's put that there. I got on a... Atlanta's so crazy. I swear, one moment you are hot here the next moment you are burning up and i just went to the door because i have all these amazon packages and threw on my little jacket because it's a little nippy today it dropped back to the 50s so i'm gonna do the peanut butter up here and let me guys let me know if you guys set up a um a little treat tray it's my little snack tray. And I'm going to put it over there where the um, coffee pot is, too. Because that's what I generally do is uh, grab a little snack and lay on that <laughs> um, when I have my coffee. So I'm alternating them, and then I'm going to alternate some up top as well. So how y'all doing today? I hope you checked out the latest video of me and the fam. We went and celebrated um, Joshua turning 20 three months he is growing 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 on us and when we look up we'll be picking him out of car and deciding what college he's gonna go to <laughs> that's just how fast it goes we have been in here okay we do have some stuff you tired of your tablet booba yeah you want a snack snack you want your fruit um you want your fruit snack you want fruit snack Joshua, you want fruit snack? No. No? Okay. No fruit snack. You want Twizzler? You want mommy to charge this up? No. No? What do you want me to do? You want it back? Okay. You want fruit snack, Booba? That's wrong. What do you want? Oh, and it does spin around. If you're interested in grabbing one. I want it nice and filled too. That way if someone takes one it's not oil. So let me get that done instead of having y'all go through this with me and I'll be back once again. Here she comes. Coffee station. Coffee station. Anyone out there have coffee station? Would you like coffee this morning? <laughs> All right, guys, so let's go through it. Okay, so we have my carrot. And this, you are able to either make a pot. Uh oh, sorry, I pulled that out. Make a pot of coffee if you're having a lot of guests over and don't want to wait per cup. Or you can put your cup under there and make just a cup of coffee. So pot, cup, here you go. There's my reservoir which I could tell hubby was the last one to use it because I keep it full. Yes, ma'am. Um, I have cups for my guests if they need one to go. That is one of my favorite cups, Jesus and Coffee. This is my little lid to keep it um, warm, even if I don't have it on my coffee warmer, which is upstairs right now, burning a candle in my, um, I'm using up the last bit of wax in my office. I, um, I still put that on there to help. This was a gift here for a frother and I have not used it yet, but I am going to. This is a new cup I got um, from Ashley. She and her girlfriends went to New Orleans and of course she had to bring her mother a cup back. So that's that cup. These are some cute little, um, what do they call it? Double pane, I think. They're like double pane um, coffee cups, clear. I love clear anything. And so I have a set of these as well. I use these more because these um, 
they hold more. These are like eight and a half. I'm thinking about getting some larger ones, but this work for guests right now, so I'm gonna leave it alone. I have my little spoons in there for stirs. There is some stevia in there, which I do not use, but I have it there for anyone that may, cause I don't buy sugar in my house. And then I have my tea whenever I wanna have tea. My Ioso tea in there. And moving right along, if you're gonna have coffee, you must have a little snack. So here is my new snack station. I call it my keto station. This is super, super packed. Packs a punch, looks great on the counter. And I'm gonna push it back a little. And, and this is the latest. Oh, I didn't show you guys where I house my coffee. So the coffee gets housed right here. We always keep this full. We have backup in the closet, boxes and boxes of coffee. So never gonna run out of coffee. I decided to put some pistachio nuts here. Um, they are a quick snack and it helps me to get my large bottle, my gallon of water per day down. So that's what I do. And this is a great gift that I have never opened. <laughs> I've had this now for about three months, and this is a coffee cup. I'm so in love with it, and I'm going to pull her out. I guess best way, I don't need to disclose the card, but here you go. Sometimes you forget you're awesome. So this is a reminder. She's a beauty. You guys know I love her because she's pink and porcelain. So here's the stir. Uh, the cup is in there. I'm sorry, the cap to keep her um, keep the coffee warm. And it's just a really, really nice, nice cup. It's a beauty. I'm sure you guys have seen it before. So I'm not going to leave her back there. I'm actually just going to leave her wrapped up until I'm really ready to use her. But I've had it. I know it has to be like over three months now. But there you go. Put her back into her coffee coffin because that's what it looked like to me i don't know what made them but i guess they have to do what they have to do to make sure it doesn't get broken but yep love her so that's the i'm not gonna say she's the latest edition because i had her before most of these up here um well definitely before her but i just haven't used it i'll pull it out when i feel like it i have so many options when it comes to cups i've been trying to do the whole buy one get rid of one and it's just not working thus far so i don't know i hate to actually throw cups out but i'm not sure if i'm gonna add any flowers i was thinking about it i have this right here and it lights up but i like this where it is especially at night once we go up for the night and that's lit up and it does go off on its own um this was a gift from hubby i don't know i think it was our anniversary or something but it's a vase that's not the original vase and um it's so gorgeous when your flowers are in there, but I figure why put it um, up? Let's put it to use. So it is on a timer and it comes on at night and it goes off before the sun comes up. But yes, this is the coffee station guy. And then we also keep coffee and stuff over here, but mostly this side is our teas and we need to replenish this drawer. This drawer was full. My husband drinks tea every single day, ginger tea, green tea. Um, this is hot chocolate for the little chunky people that come over and like sweet, sweet, sweet. <laughs> yeah, I haven't had that. But um, I shouldn't say chunky people, people that just love, you know, this in the winter time because I have like four cans of whipped cream, so yeah it's good in the winter time when the fireplace is going but yeah we're going to replenish this with some more green teas and different teas we try all kind of teas but you can see we're big on the green mostly there was an orange one that i love an orange ginger i hope ladies i hope you enjoyed it uh if you have a snack pack or not a snack pack but a snack area with your coffee station let me know i have this used to be my favorite um, cups over here. These, because they are super huge. I think they are like 20 ounces. I love them, very good quality. We actually got this as a set. My black cups, those are the regular Douglas. This today, this came from my baby girl, Ashley. Today's goal is to keep the tiny humans alive and we know she's talking about Joshua, so. <laughs> and then I also, oh, hold on a minute. I have some more over there. Joshua's station is right here. 
these are his little cups of water. When he decides he wants to waste them, waste water, we put it in here until he's ready to really drink and he drinks it out of there. Um, she also got me that New Orleans cup. I'm gonna use that for water while I'm traveling because guess what guys? We are going to New Orleans for our anniversary, yay! Ashley had such a great time. Rave reviews, They, her and her girlfriends had a great time and so we were going to Savannah and then hubby looked at me and was like, what you think? And Ashley was like, I think y'all should go to New Orleans. So New Orleans it is, guys. So you girl getting ready for that. So I'm going to stay on these little keto snacks and drinking my water and all of that. But thanks for hanging out with me, guys. And Joshua, he wasn't too bad. Hello. Hello, baby. <laughs> and I'll see you guys on the very next video.